What is the critical point of a function? So its mathematical definition is it is an interior point of the domain of a function f at which either the derivative does not exist or is zero. Such points are called critical points. That is, there are two conditions for a point to be critical point. First condition is derivative of the function is zero. That is, d by dx of the function f of x is equal to zero. And the second condition is derivative of the function is undefined. That is, it does not exist. So if any of the two conditions is satisfied, the point is a critical point. Now coming to example 1.1. Consider a quadratic function f of x is equal to x squared. So taking its derivative, now applying power rule, derivative comes out to be 2x. Applying first condition of critical point, which is setting derivative function equal to 0. And solving it for x. So x comes out to be 0, therefore x is a critical point because the derivative of function at x is equal to 0 is 0 and which is one of the conditions of a critical point. Now applying the second condition for a critical point, which is looking for points where derivative does not exist or is infinity. So by inspecting function f of x, we find out that f of x is defined for all real numbers which means there is no point where f is undefined. Therefore, no any other critical point exists for this function. So the only critical point we have for this function is x is equal to 0. So that's how you find a, a critical point for a function. Visualizing its graph, which is parabola, the derivative is 0 at x is equal to 0 as found, which means the slope of the tangent line at x is equal to 0 is 0. Therefore, it is a critical point. Now coming to example 1.2, the function is absolute value function, so f of x is equal to absolute x or it can also be expressed as f of x is equal to minus x for x less than 0 and x for x greater than or equal to 0. Taking its derivative, the derivative comes out to be minus 1 for x less than 0 and 1 for x greater than 0. The derivative of the absolute value function does not exist. Because the left hand derivative which is equal to minus 1 is not equal to the right hand derivative which is equal to 1. So as the right hand derivative and the left hand derivative are not equal, therefore derivative at x is equal to 0 is undefined or infinity. So as the derivative does not exist at x is equal to 0, therefore it is a critical point. Now visualizing its graph. So the left hand derivative which is equal to minus 1 is not equal to the right hand derivative which is equal to 1. So that's uh, why x is equal to 0 is a critical point. So thank you guys for watching. If the video helped you, give it a thumbs up, comment any question you might have and don't forget to subscribe.